For the past few months, this has been a familiar sight on the Humber Bridge as work is carried out to keep it safe for the millions who cross it each year. The project's come in at a cost of nearly £12 million. There's four of these gantries dotted across the bridge. The idea is that the work done on them will help prevent rust in the future. Well, really, you need three things for corrosion. You've got to have a base metal, you need moisture, you need oxygen. Get rid of any one of those three and you can't have corrosion. And, of course, we can't get rid of the metal because that's the bridge itself. Getting rid of the moisture, at least down to a level where it doesn't cause corrosion, is, is relatively easy. It's called dehumidification and was started after rust was found on some of the cables of the bridge during an inspection last year. They take the air from the atmosphere, they dry it out and then we pump it into the cables themselves. We use the high level gantries to seal the cables so the air that we're pumping can't escape. The work has now passed the halfway point ahead of schedule and the dry weather we saw this June has played a big part in that success. It's been fabulous for us, it really has. As you say, today is a great day again and we've had a really good early year. Um, it's allowed this work to progress a lot quicker than we expected. The outside work on the cables has really gone well. This is maintaining it at peak strength. There is some signs of rust starting to form, so that's what we're stopping. Before it really gets to the point where we lose any strength, we're stopping it. It's going to make sure that it stays open for as long as we ever need it. And with enough wire in the bridge to circle the earth almost twice, it's hoped this work will keep it standing for generations to come. Sarah Crudders, BBC Look North, at the Humber Bridge.